Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel Maths with Smart Tips. Today in this video, we are solving the questions from Modern Algebra of WB Set 2022 Mathematical Science, which is be held on 9th January 2022. In the last video, we are solving ODE, PDE, uh, Laplace, Fourier, and Integral Equation. The questions from uh, this topics. So in this video, we are solving the questions from Modern Algebra. So the previous video link uh, will be in the description and also here in the i tab so those who are new those who are not watching the previous video you must check the link in the description and also in the i tab so let's start the solution of this uh, video and before starting the solution i am requesting you to all those who are new in my channel please like the video comment if you have any doubt in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe the channel and share with your friends so start the video the question first question is from uh, it say that the polynomial x cube minus 3 1 2 3 1 2 x plus 1 2 3 1 2 3 is irreducible in fx if a is. Now this is a direct question based on Eisenstein criteria of irreducibility test. The Eisenstein criteria says that if f equal to a0 plus a1x plus a n x power n uh, this belongs to the polynomial of zx then polynomial in zx then there exists a prime p such that if p divides a i where i equal to from 0 to n minus 1 and p does not divides n that is the highest coefficients of uh, x and p square does not divides a 0 that is constant term then f is irreducible over q now if uh, here we take p equal to 3 then p divides this term p divides this term and then p divides 0 into x square so 3 divides 0 but 3 does not divides the coefficient of highest uh, degree term of x so 3 does not divides 1 and 3 square that is 9 does not divides a 0 that means this term so so this is clearly says that f is irreducible over q also you can discard the first three option by checking the irreducibility simply if we take x f x equal to this then z 3 equal to 0 1 2 so f of 0 equal to this which is divisible by 3 and this gives 0 therefore it is irreducible over z3 and z7 equal to 0 1 to 6 f0 if we put uh, 0 to the function then f0 equal to this which is again divisible by 7 therefore 0 and this is again reducible in or over z7 also if you can take z13 which uh, the elements are 0 1 to 12 then f0 equal to this which is divisible by 13 this is the <clears throat> so this is also gives 0 and uh, so therefore it is reducible over z13 so these three are discarded and it is uh, irreducible over q only so this is the correct answer option number d go to the next question the next question is a simple question from class equation uh, the question says that the class equation of the group of order 10 is now we can take the order of uh, we can write the order of uh, the group 10 equal to 2 into 5 this is of the form 2p where p is an odd prime where p equal to 5 now uh, here two cases may arise if the group g is abelian then class equation simply 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus and so on 2p times but no options uh, in the question are given like this so this uh, we don't take the g is abelian this case may not be possible this case is not possible so if we take g is abelian that means uh, if the group is non abelian then the class equation should be 1 plus p plus 2 plus 2 plus 2 up to p minus 1 by 2 times here p equal to 5 so p minus 1 means 2 so 2 times 2 and 1 plus p so 1 plus 5 plus 2 plus 2 is the correct answer for this question so this is the answer number uh, c 1 plus 2 plus 2 plus 5 also you can check this is a, there is a shortcut if these elements does not divide stains then this is not the class equation here 3 does not divide stain so this is not the class equation here also 3 present which does not divide stain this therefore this is also not the class equation correct uh, also here also 3 present which does not divide stain so it is also not possible this is the shortcut but uh, <coughs> this is the complete procedure for this problem with concept now next question go to the next question the question says that the degree of this over the field of rationals this is an easy uh, question 
if we take x equal to this then x minus 3 root 3 gives uh, root under 5 if we squaring both side then x minus root 3 square equal to 5 and so this gives x square plus 3 minus 2 root 3 equal to 5 so here also a uh, irrational present so we again we squaring both side we get x square minus 2 whole square equal to 2 root 3 square equal to 12 so there is no irrational so this is the degree that is 4 is the degree of this splitting uh, of this number root 3 plus root 5 so the degree of the this number is 4 now go to the next question question number 97 uh, this is the question says that the number of elements in the quotient ring zi over root 3 plus i is this here we use the concept zi given a plus iota b is isomorphic to z of a square plus b square if gcd of a b equal to 1 here given that zi given uh, 3 plus iota this is equal to z 3 square plus 1 square as the gcd of 3 and 1 equal to 1 and this gives this is isomorphic to 10 and we know that the number of elements in z10 is 10 so the number of elements in this the quotient ring is equal to 10 so b is the correct answer for this problem go to the next question the question says that let pq be the distinct primes and z be the set of integers then which of the following option is correct now z over p q square z is isomorphic to z p square q now the number of distinct ideals of z n equal to tau n where uh, and the number of distinct prime ideals as well as the maximal ideals of zn is equal to omega n is equal to the number of distinct prime divisors of n and this gives simply divisors of n here the divisors of p square q are p q p q and p square q in which p and q are the primes so there are two prime as well as maximal ideals and four distinct ideals so but in the question there is no option including prime or maximum ideal uh, but uh, according to the question this is the possible answer and here it should be prime ideal or maximal ideal this question is wrong uh, this question is wrong so if you attend this question you get full marks for this problem because this question has four distinct ideals and two distinct prime or as well as maximal ideal so this question is wrong possible answer is c now go to the next question question number uh, question the question says that let w be a complex number such that uh, omega be a complex number such that omega q equal to 1 and omega not equal to 1 suppose l is the field q cube root of 2 and omega generated by cube root of 2 over omega and omega over the field q of rational then the number of subfields now given that l uh, equal to q cube root of 2 over uh, and omega is a field now this q cube root of 2 omega over q is a field extension and this extension equal to we can write this q cube root of 2 over omega and q omega and q omega over q and degree of this and this should be 3 and into 2 this gives 6 so degree of the field extension this is equal to 6 now using Galileo's theorem, Galileo's group of this of order 6 is isomorphic to S3 and this is isomorphic to so as S3 and using fundamental theorem we get there is one one correspondence between subgroups of Galileo's group and intermediate field of the field extension. So the number of proper subfield k of L is equal to q q root of 2 omega such that q proper set of subset of k and this l is equal to number of proper subgroup of this Galileo's field a uh, Galileo's group this is isomorphic to s3 and which is equal to 4 so clearly 4 is our proper answer uh, answer and since the proper subgroup of s3 number of proper subgroup are this so this is clearly 4 so the answer of this question should be 4 so this is the correct answer and this is the last question for this video so if the video is helpful for you then please give a like to this video share with your friends and subscribe the channel so thank you friends see you again in the next video thank you